This game contains scenes of explicit violence and gore. Welcome to Let's Play Resident Evil. Director's Cut DualShock version. I'm gonna call it Resident Evil and leave Director's Cut and DualShock version in the tags. Oh. Resident Evil. Let me turn it up a little bit. Press any button. Any button? Well, where's the any button? Well, the left button doesn't work, so clearly it's not any button. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. Turn it up a little more. Alright, config. Yeah, the default controls are fine. Sound. Whatever. It's, it's all good. I've already seen that. New game. We'll go original. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. And I was talking with Zegjita and Miki Girl earlier today, and I was saying, oh, which am I gonna pick? And we decided, yeah, I'll do Jill Valentine's scenario. 1998, July. Oh yeah, by the way, Raccoon Forest. Oh, so they're gonna be happy raccoons and woodland creatures. Oh wait, no talking over cutscenes. I forgot, I'm sorry. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone situated in Northwest Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle Chris, of our mission. You haven't found it? No, I haven't found it yet. Stop fighting, guys! Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. Doesn't Bizarre have an E there at the end of it? Landish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. Bravo team went to the hideout of the group and disappeared. That's bad. Look, Chris. Smoke. Ah, grass. It's quite smoky here. Like, why is there so much smoke? It was Bravo team's helicopter. That's why. Nobody was in it. That's, okay. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. That is strange. However, we soon discovered why. Tell me! Why? What the hell is that? That doesn't look like a happy woodland creature to me. Hey! Come here! Come here, guys! Ew! Okay, I'm not a gun owner, but I, even I know you do not pick up a gun like that. Ew. Run! That's it. That was weird. Pansy, weren't we just running from evil death dogs from hell? Keep running. Jill, run for that house. That's the house. Dramatic head turn like that. What was it? Jill Valentine. It was all over the internet. Mary Burton. Barry. Rebecca Jeeves. What's up? What would that look? Albert Wesker. Gotta go. Gotta. Gotta make the hair look good. Resident. Spent 50 bucks on this haircut. They have escaped into the mansion where they thought it was safe. Yet. What is this? Wow. What a mansion. Captain Wesker, where's Chris? He was just with us. Stop it. Don't open that door. But Chris is... 
That sounded like a plural of Chris. What is it? Maybe it's Chris. Now, Jill, can you go? I'm going with you. Chris is our old partner, you know. Awesome. Okay, let me handle this. You handle this. We'll handle the Chris's. Stay alert. <laughs> Will do. And I'm not going to bother with editing out the going through the doors. A dining room. Dining room. I made reference to that at one point in my Dragoon LT. Oh, you know what I gotta do. What? What is this? What? What is it? Blood. Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. All right. Hope this is not Chris's blood. So do I. I'm not even gonna bother editing out myself going through these doors because I'm probably going to be talking during this anyway and I don't want to have any weird cuts in my voice. Uh, who are you? What are you eating? Is it... Ew! That hurt my ears. Maybe I have this too loud. It's Kenneth from the Stars Bravo team. Oh my god! They killed Kenny! You bastards! Now he's become a mere shadow of his former self. Uh, no, no, no. Like, if when you say he's become a shadow of his former self, that's like if someone's, like, on the street peddling drugs to, like, children or something. Or, like, if they're, like, in a back alley and, like, they're drunk and they were formerly, like, an entrepreneur or something. But no, a, a shadow of his former self is not used when you get your head bitten off. That's, what is that's not quite right. Watch out! It's a monster! I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. Because my ears are starting to hurt. What is it? Kenneth was killed too. Maybe by this creature. Anyway, let's report this to Wesker. Yeah, that sounds good. And I know that there was another ammo clip in there, but I was too nervous to go grab it from under the zombie. I'll get it later. I'm happy to have even the one right now, honestly. Wesker! Stop yelling. Well, I guess- Let me look for him, Jill. And don't leave this hall for the time being. I guess the yelling uh, is excusable on something like this. I mean, I'd be yelling too. I'd be like, holy crap, there's a zombie! Find anything, Jill? Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. Beats me too. Now it's Wesker's time to disappear. I don't know what's going on. Well, it can't be helped. Let's search for him separately. I'll no! Check the room again. No! We okay. do not. Okay, I'll try the door on the opposite side. Why are we splitting up? This mansion is gigantic. We could get into trouble if we get lost. Let's stay together. We should start from the first floor, okay? Let's stay together. And Jill, here's a lockpick. It might be handy if you, the master of unlocking, take it with you. Yeah, that's what everyone calls me, the master of unlocking. That's my college Thanks. nickname. Maybe I'll need it. Listen, if I'm something listening. happens, let's meet up in this hall. Okay. Sounds like a plan. This time, I'll be there. What do you mean, this time? I don't know of any time you weren't there. I mean, you were just, like, with me, like, the whole time through that. Except when I went off on my own, and then I saw the zombie. Alright, let's try this. Oh, yeah. Uh, wow, I'm already up to nearly ten minutes here. But... In case you've not noticed, I'm playing the uh, the fake version of the game that was released uh, uh, in 1997 on the PlayStation. Not not the real version that was released on the GameCube in 2002. So uh, I, I know I'm going to get a comment from someone saying, Oh, you must have your disc scratched or something because I'm not seeing any of the crimson heads. And I will laugh. 
you have used the lockpick. Okay, good. I'm going to cut the video here since I'm up to 10 minutes, and I will see you next time. Bye, everyone.